The Minnesota Vikings theme team. Now, I feel like every single theme team kind of has like its own strong suit. Some teams have amazing O-line. Some teams have amazing secondary. I think one of my favorite parts about the Minnesota Vikings theme team is the wide receivers. Starting out with the absolute best wide receiver in the game, and it's not even close. Gold 99, Randy Moss. And a huge shout out to my boy Nick for letting me use the squad. I respect that he put the most feared card on our Randy Moss because you could go with the Ultimate Legends art. Not a big fan of it this year. I think most fear is just so iconic. And it's a gold 99. So you know this card's gonna be legit. I mean, look at it, dude. I do think it's funny like how good theme teams make players. And I do say this once per theme team, but there's always like a golden ticket on each team. This is the Vikings golden ticket. You can't really even make this card that much better. You could add to stats that don't even need it. Like, bro, he's got 95 injury. That's uh -huh. literally a stat that doesn't matter at all. Like, it wouldn't even matter if it was 99. You can't get injured. It's got 99 speed, 97 agility, 99 excel, 96 awareness, 98 catch, 99 jump, 98 change of direction. He's got excellent ball carrier vision, less likely to fumble. His stiff arm isn't great, but his spin is 91, his juke is 98, his spec catch is 99. He's ridiculous. He has a 93 break tackle. That's what like Javante Williams has, which is insane. Oh, and super quick, I want to go over something with theme teams. So on the Pittsburgh Steelers theme team, I saw a top comment. They mentioned how I could play with any team on old gen or next gen so i shouldn't have to worry about whether the team is on next gen now i appreciate it but unfortunately there is a glitch right now and that is if someone has started a season on old gen it will not let me play on next gen this did not used to be a glitch it's recent within the last i'd say month or two it's classic <laughs> ea i don't know why it's the case so the only way i can play on next gen is if the person's team i'm using either is already on next gen or they haven't started a season in this example with nick's team as i'm learning literally right now Watch what happens when I go to click regular season. Locked. Mutt level, undefined, required. It makes literally no sense. It would let me play house rules, but I'm not gonna do that because I wanna play a full game. I think it's more fun. So we will be, we will be on old gen. Obviously I could reset their teams, but the boys are hooking me up with their squad. So I don't wanna go like reset their shit. Well, let's go back over these wide receivers. You got 98 overall Percy Harvin and 98 overall Justin Jefferson. I've loved this Justin Jefferson since he came out. He's so good team of the year. 99 speed, 99 jump. You've got multiple 99 speed wide receivers and these aren't like little, you know, Deshaun Jacksons. These are big ass wide receivers. Not Percy Harvin so much. Randy Moss is big. Justin Jefferson is pretty big. Randall Cunningham. This is one of the few teams that can legitimately use Randall Cunningham. Randall Cunningham gets all the chems, but he was obviously a Viking and he's iconically a Minnesota Viking. 98 speed, 97 throw power. This is a quarterback, ladies and gentlemen. Look at those stats. Theme teams are busted. They really are busted. Dalvin Cook. I love that Nick put Dalvin Cook here. I think that Adrian Peterson is a little bit better. But 5'10", 98 speed, 99 excel, 99 agility. The AP stats don't do him justice because it's not showing the boost from the theme team. Brian McKinney is the free safety because there's like no free safeties. Anthony Harris is kind of dog water. 99 corner Randy Moss. Yeah, they just are loving Randy Moss and I respect it. That is an insane corner. I don't think I think there will be a corner better than that Randy Moss in the game at any point. Unless a golden ticket Randy Moss corner comes out, it's not gonna be better than that. Oh, uh, we have hilarious corners. So we got Randy Moss corner, right? And then we got Mike Hughes. We also have Diggs because they flipped the positions of the Diggs brothers for backyard ballers. He's insanely good too. He's not overpowered though, six foot tall. That's how most of the corners are. The Randy Moss is insane because of how tall he is. Daniel Hunter used by Wheel'em Up, very good. Kevin Williams, 98 overall. Linval Joseph, 97. And Everson Griffin, 91. So, I mean, you could run Jack Youngblood here, who's a 99 but he's not a Viking, so I'm not gonna do that. One of the coolest things is this promo just came out, Madden Machines. If you're not familiar, the Madden Machines promo dropped this Anthony Bar, sick card art. The animation looks sick. It slows down my Xbox, but it does look sick. The 98 overall players for the Madden Machines promo have this thing called Overdrive. When you activate Overdrive, it increases the stats of all players at certain positions. For this Anthony Bar, it was, I'm gonna have to look it up because I can't, since he's powered up, I can't see it, but it does still work. Hold up. So 98 overall Anthony Barr increases D tackles, right outside linebackers, and middle linebackers with plus one power move, finesse move, and block shed. So Kevin Williams, Linval Joseph, and Broderick Thomas. Oh, and Troy Dye and Jordan Hicks are all thanking my boy Anthony Barr here for the extra stats.
Also, today's video is sponsored by SeatGeek. Live events are back, you guys know that. And of course, that includes the NBA playoffs about to kick off. And if you wanna go to games, you should definitely have SeatGeek on your phone. But they have all the tickets, whether it's football, baseball, basketball, festivals, concerts, whatever, SeatGeek has the tickets. SeatGeek is gonna take tickets from all around the web and put them in one place to make buying simple. They also give you an indicator if your price is good or not. Green is good, red is bad. And I've got a discount code for you. Use code MMG for $20 off. Off tickets at SeatGeek. That's $20 off your first purchase with promo code MMG. There's a link in the top of the description. You're gonna want the app on your phone and enjoy the rest of the video. That's the Vikings theme team. I'm insanely excited. Glad to see Harrison Smith as always. He has been a consistent stud in this league for what feels like six or seven straight years, which is insanely hard to do in the NFL. Okay, the last time I played on someone's theme team and they were three and three, I low-key lost. So I got a clutch up for my boy with the Vikings theme team. So many studs on this team. Vikings theme team, this one's like, they're so stacked at like corner and they're so stacked at wide receiver, but linebackers are all right. D-line's all right. Safeties are not that good. For Harrison Smith is good. Brian McKinney sucks. So I don't know. We'll see how this team plays. I like that they have Randall Cunningham, though. He's one of the best quarterbacks in the game right now. Joe Namath, Sean Taylor, Cam Chancellor. No theme team, just the God Squad. I respect it. But honestly, with the 96 overall and how fast my team is, this is basically a God Squad too. CJ Ham, you can't you can't forget about CJ Ham, baby. <laughs> You know, it, you can forget about CJ Ham actually if you want to. If you guys, if you guys are interested in completely fucking forgetting about CJ Ham, go ahead and do it. Oh my god, what is this nonsense, bro? This shit just started. What a fucking play, though, by Mike Hughes. He's gonna go right back to the same play. I'm gonna miss with it. What is going on, Brian McKinney? Brian McKinney, don't tell me you're about to score. You fat piece of shit. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Oh Let's go! He's got karma ran all over it, baby. Oh my God. Randy Moss, two point convert. Randall Cunningham's gonna roll. Playmaker. Oh shit. Okay, in my defense, you cannot change directions that quickly on next gen. I say that every time, but listen, that was the correct read in my brain. I love that Anthony Barr is the user. Are you really gonna spam this run play like the whole game? Is that what this game's gonna be? I just gotta find a way to stop it then if that's the case. He just runs it to the same side. It's funny how it works, you know, cause when I, when I first played on next gen, I hated it. And now like this feels so unplayable to me. Like that, like what was that? What even just happened? Good Lord, they move so fast. It's like hard to see it. Let's go Dalvin Cook underneath. Do I have jukebox? We're slowly etching our way up there. Third and five. You know what's funny? I believe in Dalvin Cook here. Yes, sir. Excellent blocks. Get around it. Getting sticky. Oh, and he switches off. You're a smart man because I was going to dust you. And we should have some room to roll out and just hit a little check down. I love that. Efficient drive here for the Vikings. See if Cam Chancellor sniffs this one out. He does, but we get an excellent block, so it doesn't matter. Damn, you can really run the ball in old gen. Adrian Peterson's in. There's nothing wrong with that. The halfback depth for the Vikings is spectacular. A little mid-draw. He got his user. Let's go. We are marching down the field. All right, we're going to hit him with a little PA crossers. He's seen a lot of the same before. Right on. No, 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 no. I, I meant to slide. I got a little bailed out there because I don't know how to fumble that. Going to go a little read option here, Dalvin Cook. Let's just hand it off. I like our numbers. That wasn't the correct read, but it didn't end up mattering. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he bites. Randall. Uh-oh. You know, that's the animation where you usually fumble. I think I, I'm getting really lucky right now. Oh, he missed. All right. I'm, I deserve that. I deserve that. That was a hell of a play by him, too, because he missed with the first guy. Percy Harvey makes a good tackle. He missed with the first guy, and he was able to switch out and make the play with the second guy. So I, I respect that. Oh, good. Wait. Run. <laughs> no. I'm not going to say it. I'm not going to say anything about old Jen. I'm just going to play. No, please tell me we stopped him. <laughs> Dude, I almost got shit on right there. We can go check down. Herndon's, Herndon's gonna have a good game. Solid stiff arm. Cannot turn the ball over though, because he gets ball at half. I have a feeling that Herndon is gonna be open. I think he's gonna bail on it. 
I could not have been more wrong. God damn, they move so fast. It's difficult for me to keep up with. I'm not gonna lie. What a loser. Dude, if he switches it up and passes on me though, he will get so many fucking yards because I'm just selling out for the run and I, I actually still can't stop it. I got the whole team on the right side. Hey, what a, dude, Brian McKinney, I talked shit about him. Brian McKinney has been spectacular. He's killing it. Oh, he's coming back this way. Brian McKinney, what a maniac, bro. He just got the turnover. Oh, you stud. Randall C's just got stupid room to work with. And I, did you see how he started to slide and then just dove anyway? I, I don't really know why. Get a little timeout. Scoring before half is going to be big here. We can still win this game. We just got to find a way, boys. You got to play smart. We got to find a way. All right, we're going to go underneath the part. Dude, look how fucking fast they just, they changed direction like physics was never invented. Talk what? to Albert Einstein about that, bud. Let's go back to the run. The run is honestly, I don't want to say broken, but it's so good, dude. I cannot put up these numbers on next gen. Come on, Vikings. We got to get in the end zone, boys. We got to find a way. Great blocks. Ooh, Dalvin's moving. How much clock is this going to chew? I have one timeout left. All right, good call. Jesus. Three-man rush just ruined me. All right, 9 to 13. I'm not particularly happy about it, but we got a focus kicker, so this should be pretty easy. 9 to 13. It's going to be a tough game, but hey, if we can find a way to clog the run, we will win here. Throw it. Throw it! No! No! I was there with McKinney, the GOAT! Holy shit, I can't believe he completed that. Oh, I got this one. Yes, sir! Give me that shit! It's still a game, baby! It's still a game! God, you get a user like a maniac on this shit. Though. Look how fast they're moving. That made no sense. I just like went inside his body and took it. Hey, yo, what the f I don't know, man. He kind of taught me something, dude. He taught me just how damn good the run is. Look at this. It's just crazy good. Look at that. I mean, he knows what I'm doing. There's just nothing he can do. I feel bad. I'm doing what he was doing, though. You know? Yeah, let's switch it up. He's gonna think it's a run. Yup, he's gonna bite down on it. Oh, what was that? What was that, you guys? Come on. Herndon is wide. This went from really exciting to really frustrating really fast. Damn, bro. I could have thrown Dalvin Cook, but I could also take off with... Did you see the angle he took? Oh, Fuck yeah. me, bro. <laughs> that made no sense. His corner took the weirdest angle. And Randall Cunningham with his second fumble. Tough. Dude, like, what? What is this? Ah! And he's running chew clock. What, do you not even enjoy playing the game? What's the point of playing? Do you just hate yourself? Are you just farming wins on head-to-head -head seasons? What are you doing? <laughs> I did know what he wanted. I just couldn't stop it. Throw it. No! Oh, I fucking laid him out. No! Oh, dude, I cracked him. I cannot believe that I talked shit about Brian McKinney, but Brian McKinney has been such a goon out here. He's been killing it. It is pretty tough to win if you fumble twice. I'll say that. Actually, I fumbled three times, but two of them are my quarterback, so that kind of makes sense. Dalvin Cook over the middle. Ouch. Kind of got rocked, but we did get a good six yards. Oh, Herndon. Oh, Jesus. This has been such a struggle today. Really, the only thing I haven't struggled is to run the ball, so I'm going to go inside zone to Dalvin Cook, and hopefully he can pick this up. And Randy Moss forgot to block the guy right in front of him. Ooh, this has been a frustrating one, boys. I mean, completely shameless, same play, air trucks that move you faster. What is this? Get a little handoff here on the RPO. Oh, God. Going the wrong direction is, generally speaking, not a good strategy. Oh, look at that play to Percy Harvin, who's going to go all the way to the end zone. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, he thought for sure I was taking off. And you can cut back so fast. Damn, that was sick. Brandon Cunningham will take it in anyway. 17 to 27. I don't think it's a game, but I got to try anyway, right? Little lefty kick here, Morton Anderson. That is not a good onside. He threw four complete passes. In fairness, I only threw eight. Uh, rushing, it was 20 for 153, two touchdowns. I was 10 for 73. So average yards per carry, I actually kept up with him. Randall Cunningham had more. Adrian Peterson had 12. So the run game is seriously strong in old gen. I can definitely say that. Uh, receiving his Justin Jefferson was solid. Hey, he's a Viking. Percy Harvin with that crazy play at the end was clutch. And Herndon, two for 25. I'm so sorry. I hate being negative, you guys. I really do. Like, I try to be positive the whole video no matter what. I mean, games like that really just aren't that fun. And I feel bad. I just lost. 
lost a game for my boy Nick, but it is what it is. You gotta take your L's, baby. You gotta take your L's. Hey, Nick, thank you for the squad. It was so dope. And thank you boys for watching as always. Next theme team video, I guess I gotta get you guys a dub. I don't know what my record is. I've won more than I've lost, but I've definitely lost a few close ones and I've lost some pretty bad. So I gotta get on good track. All right, boys, either way, I love you. Thanks for watching as always. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.